Hello, this is Michael Grant with Applied CAX, and I wanted to show how to create a plane pattern uh, relative to uh, points and lines and driven from a sketch cir circle where you can control the diameter and the planes will move relative to the circle. So here's the finished part. Um, I have the it driven by an expression. Um, in this case, I have a pattern count, um, which won't automatically create the lines. Uh, so you can kind of come up with your own definitions. And then I have the uh, pattern driven from the point pattern count. And then, of course, the pattern diameter driven from an expression called pattern diameter. So I can change this to three and a half and hit apply or uh, go up to whatever number I desire. Um, what I achieve with the lines is the plane has associativity to the line for a direction and the point for location. So in this case, I uh, needed the planes to be normal or normal to the center axis. All right, so I'll show the creation of this, starting a new model. Going to start a new sketch in the task environment. So just going to call it diameter. And then I'll put a point uh, relative to Y. And then that'll be what I drive my circular pattern from. And that's going to be relative to the sketch origin. So in this case, uh, you know, if you wanted to call this uh, some kind of expression, you could just name it right here. Point count equals six. And then 360 divided by point count. This one I usually get an error. This time it seemed to have worked. So there we go. I'm going to go ahead and make the circle reference. And then I'll show what happens if I don't add the lines. Um, I could certainly get planes on the points, and it's okay for that plane. But as soon as I go to here, um, it's possible. Yeah, no, that's not going to work. So as I cycle through that, I'm not going to get a normal to the center. And so if I back up, go back to my sketch, uh, this is the reason I added the uh, lines associative to the points. I'm going to go ahead and make those... Uh, reference and then you can see I'm over defined so the reason for this is I have a pattern but I also have these vertical constraints and uh, collinear constraints and NX knows that this is driven from a pattern so it's simply telling you it's over defined so now it is not over defined and I have some lines now I'm going to add my uh, planes and I only have point turned on and I just cycle through once I hit apply once I can now just push my center mouse button or mouse to whoops or I could have right clicked and said apply once and then it would have done the same thing 
but if you uh, don't do that and you hit the center mouse button it will say OK and close the dialog. Alright, so now we have the planes. I can hit cancel, control E to get my expressions, change my diameter, and the, uh, everything moves associative. And that is the end. Thank you.